Hey guys, welcome back to another Great Vault opening. This week is actually the last week of Season 4. I've had a lot of fun running keys this past season and sharing my vaults in the videos here on YouTube. Today we have a total of 12 Great Vaults to check out. Round my usual 10 alts. I was also able to win a couple of free carries from this past weekend's charity stream. It's going to be a lot of fun jumping into keys next week with the new talent trees, but I'm definitely going to miss my tier set bonuses. Anyways, let's get started and check out our Great Vaults. Starting out on my Alliance Mage today. This is one of the tunes that got carried. Got a Helm. It's actually my Lego slot. Maybe uh, consider moving that Legendary at some point. Checking my Horde Paladin next. I'm going to leave my loot spec as Prot. Uh, 304 boots. Couple of L4 choices as well. I can just grab the boots. That way I don't have to spend Valor to upgrade this. And we got a lower 15 on this tune for our key. Checking my Horde Shaman. Changed my loot spec to Resto. Uh, nature Damage Ring. Might as well grab it. Probably use both of these rings for enhancement. And then for our key, we got Grimrel Depot, level 16. Checking my Alliance Rogue next. This is the second tune that got carried this past weekend. Uh, 304 boots. Almost like a 50 item level upgrade. And then for our key, we got a Gambit 16. Checking my Alliance Monk next. I'm going to leave my loose pick as Miss Weaver on this one. Uh, tier legs. Already have those. I'm gonna grab the tokens. We got a Gambit 15 on this tune for our key. Checking my Horde Druid next. Have my loot spec set to balance right now. Uh, 304 Cloak. Might be good for my Resto and Balance sets. Grab the Cloak. Really good stats, I think, too. Uh, two Sockets are kind of tempting, though. A lot of my gear is missing sockets. Uh, 
I think I'll just grab a cloak. And then for a key, we've got a Streets of Wonder on this tune, level 16. Checking my Horde Death Knight next. I'm going to set my loot spec to Frost. Try to get another one-hander. Uh, DPS trinket? Might as well grab it. And then for our key, we got a 16 lower on this tune. Checking my Horde Monk next. Have my loose specs set to brew. Uh, 304 chest. It's actually an upgrade. Do already have a 288 with avoidance on it, but it's probably worth giving up that avoidance for that item level bump. Grab the chest. And then for our key, we got a Grimrail Depot level 16. Checking my Horde Demon Hunter next. Three oh four necklace. It is my legendary slot. Not entirely sure what to do here. Could maybe just move my unity. Could also just get sockets. I think I'll grab the neck. For our key, we got Iron Docks 15 on this tune. Yeah, that way if I end up moving my unity for whatever reason, I'll have a necklace to use. Checking my Horde Hunter. Have my loot spec set to Marksman. I already have my best in slot as a 304. It's actually an appearance I'm missing though. Kind of tempted to get the weapon. Yeah, I'll just grab the weapon, I think. Add it to my appearance collection. Definitely looks interesting. And then for our key, we got Iron Docks 19 on this tune. Checking my Horde Warrior next. Have my loot spec set to Prot. Uh, 304 Helm. I think we grab tokens on this tune. And then for our key, we got a Solea's Gambit level 16. Checking my Horde Warlock. 
Should actually be our last tune. Ooh, it's a big upgrade for me. It's actually my lowest item level piece, I believe. Got lucky. I'll probably just convert these into tier this week. That way I can use them in the key that I run this week for this tune. Got another Gambit? Level 15 on this tune. That's gonna be it for today's video. Even though Season 4 and Shadowlands is coming to an end, I'll likely continue to run keys. Next week, with the pre-patch and the new talent trees being added in, I think it'll be a great opportunity to try out some new builds and practice each tune. I still have to decide on my mains for Dragonflight as well, but I'll likely do that after I take a closer look at professions on the beta. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I would like to thank Nish, Lachlan, and Augusto for your support over on Patreon. Hope you guys all have an amazing week, and I'll see you all in the next video. Late.